Hi VC, Dale Gate 433. So um, I'm going to do a response to um, a video that Alan Static Traveller put out about uh, TV related vinyl. Um, I did say in the comments that I didn't have much and uh, I wasn't lying. I haven't got much. Um, so I stretched it. I've got some records, <clears throat> I've got some DVDs and I've got a book. Um, so um, and some of this I've shown before so apologies. So um, yeah so TV related vinyl well I've shown this before um, so this is the special edition of the Bagpuss soundtrack that was put out a few years ago so um, Sandra Kerr and John Faulkner um, so this comes with um, interchangeable art um, and um, all of the tracks a lot of the tracks and even more digitally so I won't say any more because I've talked about this so a couple of other a couple of other records um, I thought I'd show so a visit to Trumpton which was a children's animated um, series um, you know low-tech animation um, of the I guess late 60s early 70s Gordon Murray um, so there's that this is a bit of a beat up copy that i got from a boot sale and even more precious to me um is uh mary mungo and midge so i love and this is where perhaps music comes in so um certainly the theme tune for this was a um a johnny pearson off of a kpm release um for children and animation i think it's called um and i love both the opening titles and the closing titles of of this um, cartoon or animated series um, yeah it was a little bit twee and of its time about um, a girl and a dog and a mouse who lived in a f f set block of flats in a new town and um, the adventures they would have whilst they were she was home alone it seemed um, so uh, um, but um, I enjoyed it anyway and it was narrated by um, what's he called uh, Richard Baker a sort of BBC news reader or a newsreader of the time, um, his wonderful voice. So I enjoyed that as a child. Um, sort of continuing the um, continuing the bag puss um, is this book here, The Art of Small Films. So um, this picks up the work of Oliver Postgate um, and Peter um, Fermin. This is something that Johnny Trunk, I think, has put out. I might be bigging him up too much um but this has got some absolutely wonderful photographs of some of the seminal postgate um seminal postgate animations so there's bagpuss so it's got either the engine bagpuss um clangers um for those of you who in the uk pogles wood the clangers bagpuss over the engine nog in the nog um other ones that are most familiar to me um all beautifully photographed let me just try and so you can see there all oh, they photographed the animation pieces um, um and presented them um really nice bit of nostalgia right a uh, couple of dvds so um there's a bit of a story here so these are um, center of information films pulled together on a DVD compilation. So these are the sorts of films that um, would get played on TV uh, and or at schools, um, certainly in the seven, certainly 60s, 70s, 80s in the UK, all sorts of stuff about stranger danger and don't go near water and don't play with matches and, and all of that. But one that stood out for me um, is on this DVD and I'll put a link. I think it's available on YouTube. I'll put a link to it. And I highly recommend people watch it. Um, uh, it's about 20 odd minutes. Um, it's called Apaches um, and it was about the perils of playing on farms. Um, and I it came out in 77. I saw it in 77. One of those, you know, all the chairs laid out in a prime in primary school as I was. Um, projector onto a screen and it scared the shit out of me um, so much so that it stayed with me um, and about 
10, 15 years ago, so like pre everything being on YouTube and pre these DVDs coming out, I even contacted and phoned up the um, BFI, the British Film Institute, and um, spoke to an archivist who was prepared to actually, if I sent a blank DVD, was prepared to burn it onto a DVD and send it to me so that I can just kind of maybe expunge it from my mind by watching it. Um, it sort of stayed with me that much. Now, you probably watch it and think, well, what are you on about, Will? you wuss, it's just, but for an 11 year old sat in a school hall in a, who lived in a rural environment, um, yeah, Apache's about the perils of playing on farms. If you watch that all the way through, I think it's pretty harrowing for a, for a child. I um, wouldn't want my, my, I think, seven to 11 year olds watching it. I wouldn't want my kids watching it um, now, I don't think. But um, I hope, yeah, so as I said, not much of a video. Apologies for that. Just, but I thought I'd just chuck something in there. Um, Nice one, Alan, and uh, I know now know that when I get back to car boot sales, I need to pick up a few more TV related. I know I'm looking out for the um, Basil Brush and the Rainbow albums already. They're on my mental list. But uh, yeah, cheers. Bye.